everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be making the Beachcomber Pouch which is by Needle and Anchor Supply Co. It is a really exciting pattern to try out because they have so many different ways that you can actually make the same pattern so there's a lot of value for your money in it. I will put a link to the pattern in the description below and then we can get started. These are the pattern pieces that I have already cut out. I have also already fused my woven interfacing to the back of all of these pieces. The first step in this process is going to be assembling the front panel. So you're going to basically take these pieces and you're going to place them on these corners. And you're basically going to just sew along the edge and sew along the edge here. And then once it opens up, you're going to attach this panel on top here and you're going to stitch along the top. So I'm going to show you as I do that. Next what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my gusset and right sides together I'm going to match it with my pins all along the edges making sure that the midpoints match and after I'm done attaching it to the front panel I'm going to attach it also right sides together with the back panel and do the same for the lining pieces.
don't forget to leave an opening here so that in the lining piece so that you can flip your bag the right side out when you're done. So I forgot to do it but I opened up the seam just in time. Remember to leave your opening. Next you're going to take your four recessed zipper panels and you're going to mark a line one each one inch from the edges on each of them. So all four pieces you've seen I've marked one inch and I've drawn a line. So then you're going to place this with the right side facing up. You're going to take your zipper with the wrong with the right side facing the right side of your zipper. But it's going to start at that first one inch line that you measured. So just make sure it measures right. And you're going to line it to the top. And then you're going to take your other recessed zipper panel. You're going to basically sandwich the zipper between the two. And then you're going to sew from this marker to this line. So you'd have an inch loose on this side and an inch loose on that side. I'm basically going to do the same thing again. Place this panel with the right side facing upwards. Take my zipper. Line it up with the one inch mark on this side. Place this panel with the right side facing the wrong side. Lining up those inch marks, pinning it in place. You can open up the zipper if it makes it easier for you. Okay, now I'm going to just sew along the top. Next what I've done is I've folded in the excess one inch of fabric in and matched it to the other side. And now what's left to do is I'm going to basically just sew a box on each side along the edges just holding everything nicely in place. And then I can just trim off the excess pieces and then my recessed zipper panel is done.
Next I'm going to take my recessed zipper panel with the zipper on the left hand side and I'm going to place it with the right side facing up onto the right side of the lining fabric. And I'm going to stitch along the top and then I'm going to do the same for the other side. Next I have my lining piece opened with the zipper on the right side and I'm going to insert my exterior with the front part facing me into the bag. Next I'm going to match all of the edges together pin around the top and then I'm going to sew with the quarter inch seam allowance around, flip it the right way, do a top stitch and then I'm going to start working on the wrist strap by marking a line halfway between the two, folding these towards the middle line and then folding it in half again and then I'm going to just sew along the edges of the strap.
here is the finished beach comber pouch. I added just a little cutie in the end and I'm actually so happy with how it turned out and it is a lovely pattern. I suggest you go into my description box, click on the link and get yourself this pattern as well.